I remember when I got out of the shower and I went to my bedroom to change. Out of nowhere, my babysitter ends up walking in, saw my eggplant, and grabbed it just to make me eat dinner. Yo, what is going on, you guys? My name is Bubba, and welcome back to another really embarrassing story. So this story all takes place back when I was in high school, and this was my grade 9 year. Now, in grade 9, I managed to get a lot of different types of babysitters because my parents would always go out on vacation and do many different things since I was of age to, well, kind of, I guess, take care of myself, but not fully because I would always end up getting a babysitter but my parents never mind getting a babysitter for me and i remember one day in my grade nine year when i was heading home from school i remember i was super excited to be home because i remember there was a new game coming out that year and i just wanted to play it all day and all night and not do anything else other than play video games and i remember once i walked through my house doors out of nowhere i ended up seeing my parents with luggage near the entrance and one of them looked at me saying oh bubba uh we're going to be leaving for a couple days you will be home but there's a babysitter coming in like half an hour okay i'll see you in three days and then out of nowhere both my parents ended up leaving now this moment honestly i wasn't really phased by it nor did i say anything back because i wasn't surprised that they were doing this and to be honest i had other plans like i said earlier i was just planning to go upstairs and play video games and not do anything else so i remember that exact moment i went upstairs i ended up just you know unpacking my things from school and instantly sat on my bed and just started gaming out of nowhere like i want to say 20 minutes later i ended up hearing the door knock and at that moment i instantly just went down the stairs opened the door for the babysitter and i didn't even say hello to her i literally just opened the door and went right back upstairs I remember this babysitter. She looks at me really like weirdly and she's like, um, you know, you're supposed to say hi when you answer the door. Uh, sorry. I got other plans. I got to go is what I told her. And I went upstairs and I just closed my room door and I just started playing. It's kind of crazy now that I think about it. Cause I basically let a total stranger into my house without any supervision. But at the same time, her job was to supervise me, not me supervising her. So in reality, I just wasn't going to do her job going on from there. I remember I was sitting down I started playing my game and I'm not going to lie to you. I was just going through every mission I can possible searching up YouTube videos on how to beat certain levels and what's the best way to do it but as i was in there for i want to say four hours out of nowhere i remember the babysitter ended up walking into my room and she looks at me and says oh uh so i haven't seen you like all day are you okay like do you need anything no i'm just playing this video game why do you need something no i'm asking you if you need anything because you haven't said anything nor you know have you asked for anything like are you sure you're okay yeah i'm fine i'm just playing this new game that came out i remember that moment she came and sat down beside me and she started like asking me questions about this game and stuff and since i did some research on it before i started playing it obviously i I knew all the answers that she wanted but one thing i will say is that she was probably asking me all these questions because she wanted to get to know me but it's hard to get to know someone when you're only talking about one certain subject like it's like walking up to a girl and just talking about dogs in reality you're learning more about dogs than the actual person but going on with the story i remember one thing led to another she ends up looking at me and says okay well i'm gonna go make dinner are you hungry at all uh yeah you can make me a grilled cheese sandwich that'll be awesome i'm just gonna continue staying here and playing the game so just bring it upstairs would you are you allowed to eat in your room uh yeah is what i told when in reality i wasn't actually allowed to eat in my room but what she was just my babysitter obviously she wouldn't know that so i remember this babysitter goes downstairs gets food ready and then comes back upstairs and gives me my food and just basically leaves me alone i remember hours went by and i want to say like more than five to six hours and it was definitely like getting super late because i remember when i looked outside it was like super dark out when i checked my phone for the time i saw it was like basically like almost three in the morning and when i saw it was three in the morning i was like whoa like it's getting really late but at the same time i didn't really know if i wanted to get off so so I remember I ended up going downstairs real quick to go get a glass of water because, well, I always like to get a glass of water before I go to bed. And when I got my glass of water, I remember I went straight upstairs and I basically started playing the game a bit longer until I ended up passing out. Comment down below if you guys have ever passed out during a video game and what video game it was, because I'm not going to lie to you. Passing out during a video game really shows your passion for the game that you were playing. I remember the next day I ended up waking up out of nowhere and right as I opened my eyes, I am not joking. I looked at my TV that was on my wall and I saw that I was still in the middle of a video game so i ended up actually just picking up my controller again and continued the game literally first thing i did was wake up and start playing video games it's actually kind of insane but this is where things get really crazy because i remember i want to say like 20 minutes went by and out of nowhere i ended up seeing the babysitter that was at the house end up walking into my room saying oh you're awake and you're back on playing the video game uh yeah i just want to beat this mission you do realize you've been playing this game all night right uh yeah what about it okay well i'll just leave you alone i guess yeah that'd be cool thanks and this babysitter ended up leaving. Now, I will say this. I was being really rude to her, but at the same time, like I said earlier, ever since I got home, I had a plan to play this video game. So obviously, I'm going to play it. I remember four hours went by. And once again, I was still playing this game. I don't know how, but I just kept playing this game. And I even got to the point where I actually had a water bottle that I ended up, you know, pissing in because, well, I didn't want to go to the bathroom because I was in the middle of a cutscene. So obviously, sacrifices were made, people. But out of nowhere, I remember my babysitter ends up walking into my room and she looks at me and says, okay, Bubba, seriously? 
Literally, you've been playing this game for like over like two days now. I am not joking. You need to take care of yourself. Okay, well, I'll do it later. No, I think you're going to do it right now. My opinion, go take a shower. Uh, I don't really want to. Let me just finish this mission real quick. I remember this babysitter got really fed up with me and she got so upset to the point where she actually ended up walking up in front of my TV and she turned off my Xbox. She turned it off and said, go take a shower now. The game can wait. Oh, fine. Whatever is what I told her. And I instantly just got up, went straight to the bathroom and I just took a shower. I remember when I got into the shower, I was so annoyed and super upset. So I ended up speed running the shower and I am not joking. I was probably in the shower for like less than five minutes. And basically right after my shower, I ended up getting out of the shower, putting on my towel and walking straight back into my room. But when I got inside my room, I ended up seeing my babysitter sitting on my bed, looking at me saying, Bubba, there is no way you showered less than five minutes. There is no possible way you're actually clean. Uh, well, I did. So what about it? Baba? no, seriously, go back into the shower and finish. Finish what? I'm not going to go take a shower. And I'm not joking. When I said that, I did not expect her to do anything because usually babysitters wouldn't do anything. But this babysitter was different because I remember this babysitter ends up walking up to me, takes off my towel and grabs me by the eggplant and says, Baba, you're going back into the shower now. At that moment, I was looking down and I started getting bricked because she was obviously holding my eggplant and she she could definitely feel that I was getting bricked. And I remember this babysitter ended up looking down at her hand that was grabbing my eggplant. And she says, okay, you know what? This is getting weird. You think? is what I said afterwards. And then she ended up basically grabbing it tighter and walking me back to the bathroom just to go back into the shower. At that moment, I felt violated. But at the same time, I was actually kind of like, you know, bricked up because obviously that's kind of hot. Not going to lie. But I was super annoyed. And I'm not joking. I ended up taking a full on 20 minute shower, got out of the shower, went back into my room and started playing the game. But as I was playing the game, I remember the babysitter ends up walking back into my room. Like I want to say like an hour later. And I remember during a cutscene, this babysitter was just standing there. And she said, Baba, I just want to say like, I'm sorry that that happened i was just really fed up and like you were starting to smell and i just wanted you are you even listening to me yeah just give me a second let me finish this cutscene. when she saw i was not paying attention to her she ended up finding out a way to get my attention and that was by pulling her shirt up and she pulled her shirt up and i saw her cherries out and she said bubba are we even now uh yeah we're even is what i said staring at her cherries and your parents are not gonna find out about this right yeah no i'm not gonna say a word okay sweet she ended up pulling her shirt down and she went back downstairs and just mind her own business but at that moment on i'm not gonna lie to you i was actually kind of like amazed about what this babysitter did because not only did she get me to take a shower during grind time but she also got my attention from my cutscene that was very important into the story i'm not joking i ended up having to like reload a save file that i had just to rewatch the cutscene but hey what can i say cherries are my weakness and also if you guys want a babysitter like this one my suggestion is to fall for more embarrassing stories peace out guys